Drunk driving arrests over the Labor Day weekend have increased over the past two years. There were 34 arrests over Labor Day in 2021. That went up to 62 arrests in 2022. DWI enforcement is a key part of training for all SAPD cadets, and now we're getting an inside look at some of that process. RJ Marquez and photojournalist Adam Barasa take us inside SAPD's DWI wet lab. This is not your typical watering hole, but SAPD's wet lab is open for business and serving drinks for a purpose. This is all part of SAPD's training academy. You're going to advise them their, of their rights. A chance for these cadets to learn to identify drivers who are near the legal limit. And while participants get to have some fun and free drinks in a controlled environment, SAPD says there's science behind the wet lab. It's actually a scientific experiment where participants uh, who are willing to consume alcoholic beverage are actually given a certain amount of dose to get them right at the legal limit. Uh, whiskey, vodka, or rum. Each participant has to answer a series of questions before entering the lab. Do you want to be above or below the legal limit? They're assigned a letter and a designated glass to drink out of. We ensure that they have designated drivers. We also ensure that they haven't had anything to consume alcoholic beverage today. Okay. Okay. So we're inside the wet lab right now. You can see the drinks are going and the participants are still seated behind me. All of these drinks here have been predetermined by a person's weight, height, and gender. So once we're done here, we're going to head over to the gym where the field testing will take place. You will look at your foot while you're counting. Now it's on the cadets to identify who is either over or under the legal limit. Officers can identify different clues while they're performing sobriety tests that they'll be conducting roadside as well as the participants even understanding the um, actual impairment. These cadets go through a minimum of 40 hours of DWI training. The wet lab is a key exercise before they hit the streets for the real thing. It really truly is the life saving that officers do. It's preventive in nature. It's not to arrest people. It's preventive in nature to stop the fatality crashes, to stop the uh, uh, all the property damage and things of that nature. Based off that, I, I would arrest you for DWI. RJ Marquez, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.